morning and thanks for tuning in. I'm Larry Suvarov. And I'm Calvin Saucer. Today is Monday, February 13th, and this is RT Today, brought to you by... The D.B. Cannon Studio of Dance, Middletown's home for dancers. Happy birthday today to Jace Domelik, Rowan McCullen, Britt Poffenberger, and Aaron Jackson. On this day in history, in 2000, the last Peanuts comic strip was published in newspapers, just hours after the death of creator Charles Schultz. Now, let's go to Larry with a wrap-up of today's headlines. It's Calvin. In news, the USA shot down an unidentified object over Lake Huron. This is the third object destroyed since the Chinese spy balloon. The defense officials declined to identify the three objects that were shot down over the weekend and are not ruling out any possibility for where these objects came from. In entertainment, Rihanna took the halftime show stage last night in an all-red ensemble. Fans suspected the star's pregnancy while viewing, and rumors were confirmed after by, or the show by Rihanna's representatives. This will be the be Rihanna's second pregnancy as she gave birth to her son this past May. In sports, last night, the Kansas City Chiefs beat the Philadelphia Eagles 38-35 to to win the Super Bowl. Patrick Mahomes, quarterback of the Kansas City Chiefs, was named Super Bowl MVP. This is the Chiefs' second Super Bowl win in, in the last four years. That's a wrap. Let's go to Calvin with today's announcements. Thanks, Larry. The MHS Key Club is hosting a Sleep in Heavenly Peace twin bedding drive from Monday, February 13th to 17th. Items needed are new twin sheets, twin comforters, blankets, throws, and new pillows. Items can be dropped off in the front vestibule area or at the girls' home basketball game against Walkersville tomorrow. The junior class will be holding a fundraiser at Chipotle on West Patrick Street on Wednesday, February 15th from 4 to 8 p.m. Take your Valentine out to dinner. Attention all spring athletes trying out for the boys' tennis team. By the end of today, contact Mr. Kim via Schoology or stop by room 216 to join the Schoology group to receive information on the upcoming season. In sports, on Friday, the girls' varsity basketball team beat Frederick 48-41. Talia Jenkins had a double-double with 12 points and 14 rebounds. Riley Nelson had 6 rebounds, 6 steals, and 5 assists. The JV team also won. Abby Wiggle had 12. The boys' JV and varsity basketball teams fell to Frederick. The girls' varsity track team placed second in regionals. Ava Allen placed first in pole vault and 55 hurdles. She will also be going to states in the 55. Haley Lucido placed first in the 500 and second in the 800. Kaylee Franklin qualified for states in the 500, and the girls' 4x8 qualified for states. The boys' team placed seventh. Levi Zilnus placed second in high jump, and Tommy Stokes got third in pole vault. Both of them will be going to states. Heidi Tomlin won counties in the 100-meter breaststroke. The varsity wrestling team fell to the eventual champion, Stefan Decatur, 33-25 to in state semifinals. Go Knights! There are no games tonight. That's all the announcements for today. Let's take a look to today's weather. Thanks, Calvin. It's currently 44 degrees outside and sunny. It's going to be nice all day with a high of 53 degrees, so make sure to get outside this afternoon. That's it for weather. I'm Kaden Ratliff. Back to you in the studio. Thanks for watching. You can get, find more content on mhsroundtable.com or you can download our app, Stu News Source, for access to our articles, videos, and podcasts. I'm Larry Suvarov. And I'm Calvin Salser. We leave you with this final thought. Hi, I'm Matt Murray. And I'm Alex DeVrant. And here's, here's something, something to think, think about. about. Do, Do the, the best you can. can.